Good morning. Welcome back to Bird Feed. This is Trish and I'm here this morning with another Operation Christmas Child unboxing. And this one is for a girl aged 10 to 14 and it's an under the, the sea theme. So it is quite bulging. I have to keep it closed with a rubber band. <laughs> But um, this is what she'll see when she uh, opens her box. And right off the bat, we have um, her wow item, which is this cute plush seahorse. Now, it didn't come with the pearl around it. Uh, that's a little bracelet that I added. And I paid $3 on clearance from Marshall's. Uh, for it and I had wanted to do an under the sea theme and I wasn't sure what I was going to do for my plush or my wow item and I saw this and I thought oh my goodness this is perfect so um, then I I had this per little pearl bracelet um, forever I, I mean I've had it literally forever and have never worn it it came in a set with a necklace that I did wear um, and I thought, well, this would be the perfect box to put it in uh, so this little girl um, could enjoy wearing this uh, pearl bracelet. And, uh, of course, I put it in because it's pearls, because pearls come from the sea. I found this water bottle that had um sea turtles all over it it's bpa free and it's in the colors of the box are also like a pink and aqua and um it fit the colors of the box in it i have i have stuffed it full i've got hair ties i've got a um is this this is an energizer um flashlight and extra batteries. Um, I found a cute pair of sunglasses um, that I put in this bag to keep it from getting scratched. But they are um, like mirrored sunglasses with a ombre effect. I thought they were real cute. Uh, in it, I also have a comb a blue toothbrush, uh, we've got an assortment of pencils and pens, I put in a, a couple of matchbox cars, a pink Cadillac that you have seen from my other unboxings, and a, this is a, like a ni Nissan, I don't know, 370Z, and a glue stick a cherry chapstick. Um, I, well, it's chap ice. I get these from the Dollar Tree. They're, they're actually not, not bad. I've used them before myself. Um, they come three to a pack, so it's 33 cents a piece. And I put in a bunch of uh, cap erasers and a pencil sharpener and a glitter bouncy ball. A sil it's silver. So that's what fit in this water bottle. So you can see it when it doesn't have all that stuff in it. It's got all those cute sea turtles on it. I found from Dollar Tree an assortment of sea animal coloring books and drawing um, inst instructions. This is I Can Draw That, Ocean Animals, and it has um, how to draw different sea creatures in it, explaining how to draw. So I thought that was cool. And I found a Sea Life coloring book. This is one of those adult coloring books. So, um, it you know, the, the pictures are... A, a bit more in, intricate, but I thought uh, an older girl would enjoy 
uh, coloring in one of these. I also found this Ocean Creatures sticker activity book, which has an assortment of uh, sea creature stickers in it, and then ocean scenes with the places where you put the stickers and create the scene. I included, of course, a spiral notebook. This one is a college-ruled sp spiral notebook. I got this at ten, for 10 cents at uh, uh, Walmart. I included three pairs of girls' underwear. Um, I got these at a department store near me called Kohl's, and they had them, I think they were on sale, and I had an extra percent off sticker, and I had $5 Kohl's cash, and in the end, I paid $6.90 for a package of 14 pairs of girls' underwear, so that was a pretty good, pretty good deal. I was able to fit in a jump rope in pink for this young lady. Um, also to go with her little pearl bracelet, I found some hair accessories um, with pearls on them. This is a, a decorative bobby pin and a hair clip. And I'm gonna keep these in the packaging um, to keep them from getting fingerprints and scratched up, but um, I think she will enjoy those. I found a cute puzzle. This is a hundred piece um, puzzle. It happens to be in plastic, so I hope there's not a big glare on that, but um, it's a dolphin with an assortment of colorful under the sea um, creatures, and it's under the ocean. And I cut the puzzle top. This wasn't a collapsible box, so I cut the, the top off and I put it in a uh, plastic Ziploc bag so she would be able to um, store the puzzle pieces after she played, played with it. Um, I put in a sketchbook so she'll have a place to sketch her uh, I Can Draw animals. I included a pair of scissors additional school supplies, and uh, 24 colors of crayons, uh, 25 cents from Walmart. I included colored pencils. Um, I thought those would be good for when she sketches her um, sea creatures from her book, instruction book. I included a pink uh, pencil case and a pink ruler an aqua blue soap case with a bar of soap. I didn't find an under the sea creature uh, tote bag, but I did find this beautiful one has butterflies on it and in the colors of her shoe box, the aqua and pink. I included a nice quality washcloth. I get these at Costco in a 24 pack for $12, so they're 50 cents a piece. And last but not least, another package of stickers of um, sea creatures. And that is the 10 to 14 girls under the sea shoebox. I hope you see some things here that maybe give you some ideas of what you'd like to put together for your shoe boxes and maybe some places to shop. And if you liked, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe so you can see uh, some of my other upcoming videos. I have 40 boxes I'm doing this year, so I'm, I'm going to try my best to put out at least three or four boxes a week uh, so I can get them all out by uh, the end of October. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.